So, Sandera, what would you say would be some of the activities you get involved with when you're not playing football? Oh, basically, it's just, it's just like just just sitting around, you know, sometimes get so caught up into a lot of things that's going on. It's like sitting around just trying to find yourself. And, and I sit around and try to, you know, get caught up on my schoolwork, try not to get behind with that. And, and other than that, it's like basically trying to be like big brother to like 100 guys. What would be some of your pregame rituals that you do before the game in order to get fired up or fire up the team? Oh, man, I, I kind of look at myself as maybe like a little old-fashioned. You know, I don't too much do too much, too many things. Or before the games, you know, you might have a lot of guys looking at me, telling me I calm down and, and stop doing it, stop laughing. You know, I may be joking. I may be, you know, we might be joking and talking about somebody, you know, right before the game or maybe sitting down and listening to music. You know, it all depends on how I'm feeling. The X Factor on the team right now. And I was just wondering, if you do not get drafted into the NFL, what would be your plan in life? Oh, man, I got... I got a lot of high expectations, you know. I, I never, I always dreamed of playing football, and I guess it's a dream that came about when I was in high school. So I really didn't too much dwell on that, you know, just going to the NFL. But now that it's there, you know, I try and get that. But other than that, I always dwell on like, you know, just like a community guy. Cinderic makes it his duty to stay involved in Pace Mobile community. He remains a great role model for his city on and off the field. He feels it's important you gain the correct perspective of the player and the person. This is Carl Kane signing off with Eagle News.